This is a video walking through how to use Vision within Power BI. Vision is a part of Cognitive Services in Azure, which offers a range of pre-built models made by Microsoft to customers via REST API. And utilizing that without knowing how to code or how to build your own machine learning model, you will be able to analyze images and extract information from those images and use that for your analysis or application. Microsoft has made cognitive services, in this case Vision, available in Power BI with the goal to democratize AI. So without knowing how to build a machine learning model that analyzes images, you'll be able to extract tags from those images and build an interactive visualization for your um, users using vision. So first, let's take a look at the data we have today. We have some image URLs from the web, and let's click on vision. You will need to be in the Power Query Editor, and you go to the Power Query Editor by um, clicking Transform Data. So we can click on Image Tags, and notice that this is actually running on your local premium capacity. Um, so it's not sending your data over to the Vision API and get the results back. It's actually um, running locally on your premium capacity. So it's relatively fast to render the results. So you can see that we have the text available as well as um, tag. So that's basically the pivoted out version of text. And then you have the um, confidence level of the text as well as the error messages. You will only see error messages if Power BI is not able to recognize your image URL. So let's go back to the report and build a visualization based on the text. And we will build it so that our customers will be able to interact with the images using the text. So first, let's drop in the URL. As you can see, Power BI defaults these to text, so it's not showing up as images. What you need to do is to change the data category to image URL. And once you've done that, Power BI will be smart enough to figure out these are images and show the images themselves. And then we can drop in the text to show what um, these images are about, and then drop in tag and to build a visualization with a bar chart and the frequency of the, these tags appearing. And then now we can interact with both visuals by selecting different um, tags and then different images on the right will dynamically render. Thank you very much for watching this video.